what if what if you could remove the most stubborn makeup with just a little water? Well, we're going to put the, a product to the test today. It claims to do just that. And our good friend, Dr. Batra, is back to help us out. And first things first, of course, Dr. Rachel's backstage in our green room to test it out. Take it away, Rachel. All right. Well, you know what? I'm here with Leah and Charvel, and they are about to try out this product called the Makeup Eraser. Now, what they've done is they both put on a lot of makeup. They've got on that heavy... A studio makeup that we all wear and what we're gonna do is kind of do a contest to see which one does better with makeup removal is it the magic eraser or is it just a regular towel and water now I use this at home so I'm really interested to see how the results show all right so ladies are we ready yeah. we're ready okay <laughs> let's dip and take it off go to scrubbing so I think what we were all so excited about this segment because as the ladies start to scrub you know, we do wear a lot of makeup for TV, but even if you wear foundation with a sunscreen or powder, it is hard to get it off. And as you scrub and scrub and scrub, it can cause damage to your skin. So I find like I'm walking around with a bright red face all the time because to get this mask of makeup off. So can you tell us about the science with this? So, I love it. So the idea behind this is it's actually science and physics at work. So all she's using is water, and this is a microfiber cloth. So the idea is that it's got millions of little tiny fibers that are about 10 to 50 times thinner than a human hair. And there's so much surface area that it actually relies on the physics of the attraction between ions. And this is microfiber technology. It's been around for years. It's being used in cleaning, but I think this is such a cool application of the science in day-to-day -day oh. life. Now, Dr. Batra, I have a question for you because I've been using this magic eraser at home for maybe a couple weeks. And what I started to notice, though, is that underneath my eyes, they just started to kind of get drier. And I stopped about two days ago because I thought maybe it was a little too much for my face every day. So what do, you, what do you think about that? So I think the way the, the product actually works is it's sucking up the makeup particles onto the fibers. It's just like if you've ever seen a gecko and it's stuck to the ceiling. It's because of all those tiny, tiny hairs on the feet of the gecko are creating forces between the ions, an attractive force, and that's why it sticks. That's why this product works, but because you're not maybe using a more moisturizing or emolliating cleanser afterwards, it might not be enough for you. Well, no, she's so, done. Yeah, I, she I, is well, done. So I, I think the verdict is out here. Here we have Charvel. She is pretty much makeup free in less than a few minutes. And then we have Leo, who's still I'm curious. struggling with her eye makeup was... Leah's makeup, do you think, thicker? Was there some oh, reason? Yeah. Because, no offense, Leah, you're not done yet. <laughs> Travis, it sounds like the magic makeup eraser might be for you because we have Charvel here who used the magic eraser. She has no makeup left. She had on the same amount, the same thickness, the same eyeshadow as Leah, and Leah just <laughs> used the washcloth and water, and she, you know, she still Magic eraser too. Carvel, you better hold on to that towel. Travis is coming in. Travis is on his way back. Here we go. Here we go. Here's your magic eraser. How much do we have left in this show? Now the good thing about it too is you just put it in the wash machine after a couple uses. And, and it's, it's what, like twenty dollars, right? Twenty bucks. Yeah. Am I allowed to do the rest of the show without makeup? <laughs> Dr. Batra, why didn't you think of this? I wish I had. But it's it's actually, I mean, if you think about the physics and the chemistry, yes. it's amazing. And then the other thing is actually the size of the fibers is about the same size as a typical bacteria. So something oh. like this is antibacterial as well. Oh, I feel so much better. Okay, yes. <laughs> I feel so much better. Yes, that was on my face and there's more coming off.